Hello and welcome to Five Drive School of Motoring. It's Mohammed. I hope you guys are doing great. In this short video, we're going to be talking about how to take fifth exit on idle roundabout. Okay, guys, so this is the satellite image of uh, five lane ends roundabout i've been requested to make this a video in one of the comments this roundabout is not really difficult to deal with but it can be quite uh, busy sometimes so you have to be very careful anyways uh, let's see how we are going to deal with it so this round is, roundabout has got five exits okay so if you are coming from Swain Lane, that is your part of test. It could be part of your independent driving. You might be following uh, Satnav here. So the, you will be coming from here. Um, this is Swain Lane, right? S I think it's Swain Lane or something. Anyways, Swain House Road or something. Anyways, so you're going to enter from here in the right lane and you'll be taking fifth exit so this exit is on the uh, this exit on the left is your first exit this is your second exit that is your third exit and this one is your fourth and here is your fifth exit right and this is the exit you will be normally taking on the test day if you are uh, um, if you are coming from Swain house road uh, okay so just very important thing here is to be patient because as I said before as well this roundabout can be very 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 busy sometimes so obviously when the traffic is coming from the left side here and they've got the left signal on it means they will be turning left but the problem this roundabout is traffic is also coming from here and they might not be signaling signaling because they are going um, straight okay yeah you will still have to stop traffic also comes from here and sometimes that traffic doesn't signal as well and they are in the right lane and just falling um, this lane to take this exit okay so you've got to be very careful with this exit this one and this one you've got to look in all three direction what's coming towards you as I said sometimes people coming from here don't signal as well ideally they should be going straight ahead but they do not signal, which can be a bit confusing. You might think you they're going straight at, but they enter in the roundabout in the right lane and they come into this direction in front of you, okay? So once the gap is there, you, you've got to enter into the right lane, okay? Just make sure it's all safe in all three directions, okay? Sometimes traffic is in this lane, but they're not signaling. So they should definitely be going straight into this lane, which means it would be safe to pull out of the roundabout. So once you have entered the roundabout, you're going to be in the right lane. You've gone past first exit, second exit on the left, third exit. You're still in the right lane. Now you've just gone past the fourth exit. Now here at this point, as soon as you go past the fourth exit, Check your center mirror and left mirror and signal left and gradually start to move into the left lane. And then you will be able to take this exit here, fifth exit. You don't want to keep in the right lane for too long and then suddenly take the exit because someone might be in your left lane here. So again it's just about being patient there you have to do this uh, with your instructor quite a few times before you can get used to it okay so this exit here is i believe idle road 
Right, okay, now what I'm gonna do is I am gonna actually go there and I'll drive on to that roundabout and I'll try and take a fifth exit. Okay, there we are. Um, again, we are on uh, Swain House Lane. I think it's Swain Lane. Uh, Swain House Lane or Road, I don't know, I can't remember. But anyways, we're heading towards the roundabout and um, we're gonna be taking a fifth exit. Okay, so we're going to about check your center mirror, right mirror signal right now. Stay in the right lane, approach nice and slowly. Have an early look on the right. The black car is gone. It seems all safe after the white car. Slow down, have an early look. Try and select your gear early. So we've gone past the first exit with the white van is gone. That's second. This is third. And now we're just going past the fourth exit. Now check your center mirror, left mirror signal left and move into the left lane gradually. And this is how you take the fifth exit. Again, as I said, it wasn't as busy this time, but it can be busy. So just be patient. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.